Hello and welcome to Hadoop exam learning resources. In this session we are going to cover the uh, very important topic that is uh, fifth one that is understanding uh, difference between block, input split and record. Okay, so let me clean out the screen first and then we'll come back. Okay, so what exactly is the process happens in the when Hadoop map is uh, works actually so let's assume this is the file that is very big file uh, assume that is one gigabyte file your map just framework has to be processed and so this file when as soon as you submit to the HDFS it is divided into the blocks of 64 MB 64 MB right 64 MB block and this block would be processed by the each mapper so i would say this is one block would be created this is another block and this three block needs to be created and needs to be processed by the mapper okay these are the mapper so as you know by default each mapper process each block correct but in between there are two com more components one is input split another is record data that is input split and one is recorded now it's recorded so and this is block by default the size of the input split is the same as the block size by default okay but why we see the size is, is the in, in the input split this is not actually the size this is just information which contains like what would be the block size which i am going to process so it says like it has byte set uh, what byte uh, what i would say byte offset information uh, this input split that just doesn't contain the data this is just a logical representation of the block and this is actual physical which needs to be processed okay so before reaching the data it goes to process by the input split and input split and then there is a one more component that is input format which is responsible for creating that input split and record reader object so input split is logical representation of block and record reader is responsible for reading the record the record from the block and then submit each record to the as a key and value format to the mapper and this key is the just byte offset in case of the file and in the other file format it could be the different again value is the actual record their actual line from the file this could be present uh, it, that needs to be processed and now the, there is one important thing like it is not necessary inputs and block size should remain same like it's like sometimes there is a requirement like i want to process my whole file as a single uh, record or something like i don't want my files to be divided in multiple things there are reasons uh, why i don't want to be this uh, 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 i don't want to be divide this whole file into the block there is like i wanted to check like my whole file is in the sorted order or my this record is dependent on the previous record this kind of requirement that and in this scenario my whole file should be processed by the single mapper only and to do this thing i will set the my input split size to be the like the file size okay one default size like one thing which we i can do it or another option is i would say is a splitable method on the input format Will return false so my file won't be divided into the in so like my file C would be divided into the block and this block could be like in main node one this is a uh, sorry data node one this is data node two and data node three this block is on three different nodes still this three blocks on three different nodes but i will create like my file won't be splitable so like this thing this whole three blocks would be processed by the single input split and then input split size would be the equal to the size of the file so that input split will say whole file size is one gigabyte and that whole file would be processed by the single mapper so that is how you can avoid like splitting the file and the once and the, the responsibility of creating the record reader is like subclasses of the input form okay so there are different kind of input format which we will discuss in the uh, uh, if in module 10 of the actual 
train full length training that is where we have discussed each and every topic okay so so this way it's like all block and uh, input speeds and record header differ and the mapper is responsible is like where you have like requirement i don't want my file to be splitted it has to be processed by the single mapper okay so that's all where we see what is the difference between maybe block input script and record mapper. okay thanks for the listening so now in our full length training in the module 10 like we have to, as of now 15 modules they are uh, like this is the 10th modules and we have already covered the uh, total 14 modules have been created so as of now 15 modules are ready to be uh, learned how to so in this module 10 we are going to uh, we have covered the serialization various input format like uh, and how come small files can be combined how input sizes computed and how output format is varies based on the data type so this kind of like 70 minutes full length training is available as an uh, module 10 and full training is like could be like 15 modules that is almost uh, uh, in total is like 16 hours recording something it's good to okay so this, this is one of the products so hadoopexam.com is our main website and we have various products for the like cert hadoop certification if you are going for Hadoop certification, then we have developer simulator, which contains 200 questions and plus revision notes to prepare for the Hadoop certification. Second is we have admin simulator, which contains 240 questions for the your administration exam preparation of the Hadoop. And third product is Hadoop training, which we have already 1000 plus subscriber for this. And uh, the next product which is we are going to launch soon that is HBase simulator that would contain the practice questions for the HBase and after that we are also going to create Cassandra training Apache Cassandra uh, which will be so I would suggest you keep visiting hadoopexam.com and you can use either of our paid subscription based on your requirement and even if you are going to buy more than one product we are giving some discounts so please consider that as well thanks for listening and yeah i hope you will enjoying our free lessons as well thanks thanks